Now, at the same time, with only 58 days to go to the August 9th polls, civil society groups under the umbrella of the Uchaguzi platform and the Kenya Bishops' Council are demanding that the IEBC resolves all pending electoral issues, including the publication of the 2022 voter register. Oh, the group also wants IEBC to bar all public officers from engaging in campaigns using public resources. Safi Godana Mamo reports. Attention. At the top of the civil society and Kenya Bishop Council's list of concerns is the increasing involvement of public servants in political campaigns, using public resources either to further own political ambitions or pushing politicians' agenda. And those people who are having state jobs and are agents of the state who are employees of the voter must serve all the voters equally without appearing to lean on one side of any of the presidential candidates. We call upon public servants to refrain from this behavior and implore on relevant government bodies to hold these public servants to account and deter these actions of impunity. The civil society group comprising Zalendo Trust, Transparency International, ELOG, Constitutional Reform and Education Consortium has also raised a red flag over the electoral technology to be deployed in transmission of results come August 9 polls. They say given the simulation exercise conducted last week Thursday by the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, IABC, that proved only 45% success rate, much needs to be done ahead of the polls. The challenges that were witnessed with respect to the the test, the simulation exercise that was conducted on the 9th, uh, it is our considered view that there are still hitches, uh, with especially with respect to results transmission, that if left unchallenged and unaddressed, then we potentially will, will have problems with results transmission in August 2022. The issue of the 1,111 polling stations lacking 3G and 4G network coverage has also been pointed out as a matter of concern. The group says assurance by the electoral body notwithstanding the huge number of uncovered stations would have implication on the integrity of the whole electoral process if left unsettled. For IEBC and other entities to disclose so that they are not a ghost polling stations that are somewhere that would be used on the 9th August to generate uh, results that are, um, you know, used to, to doctor the results of the elections. The groups, citing the invalidation of 2017 presidential election results by the Supreme Court on the basis of how IEBC transmitted the results electronically. With only 58 days to the August 9th polls, civil society groups are concerned that failure by the Electoral Commission and other stakeholders to address pending pertinent electoral issues, the 2022 general elections might not be free and fair. Safi Godanamamo, Citizen TV, Nairobi.